Hello Pokemasters and welcome back to Dan Dan Pokemon Adventure and today we will be looking at this wonderful Reshiram and Charizard Premium Collection GX box. Now this is something special because I actually found it at Walmart, believe it or not. So I found Pokemon cards back in the stores. That's right folks, the holiday cheer is here and so is this box. So let's Let's get into this. The Pokemon party has cleared. Everyone has moved on. They are all in a box on one of my many shelves where they will probably never be heard from or seen again. So, exactly where they wanted to end up after their Pokemon party has reached its, well, its final conclusion, which was them having a good time, good laughs, and some good food. Here we have the Reshiram and Charizard GX gold card and of course the big daddy which is the mega version of the same card so that's pretty sweet it's a good promo and we also get 10 that's right 10 packs baby 10 packs and not one of them is the celebrations that we are trying to complete here's the code for you take it enjoy it this is a holiday treat this is just for you guys someone just got that box to use online tell me what packs you get tell me if there's anything good no one's been telling me uh if anyone's getting these codes no one's been telling me if there's anything good coming out of them i haven't heard from anyone if there's good stuff coming out of these codes boxes or not anyway guys we've got one two three four five packs of chilling rain we've got two vivid voltage and three evolving skies and i think that's probably good because i don't know much about this chilling rain i know they're moved on to the next series already but chilling rain i could not get a hold of so when these came out i didn't really touch many of these so hopefully we're gonna get something good there i'm not a huge fan of vivid voltage i didn't think the series that i everything i opened wasn't that great and i do like evolving skies i think this was the most fun of the um ones that have been recent so let's start with a crack at chilling rain to see see what we can get in chilling rain haven't like i said i haven't seen too many of these cards i'm tried not to spoil too much online for myself come on just show me the there we go the code for the boys and girls at home all the pokemasters watching this get a code there's a darkness energy we'll set that to the side we've got the little dancing girl we have got the old lady the young lady the octopus of clay the drummer boy this, uh, what is Sneasel? Like a, a weasel thing? I, I don't think he's actually like a weasel, but I always thought he was because his name was Sneasel. The worm, the duck, ooh, score bunny in the snow, pushing, building a snowman. Really nice, and nothing, just, just Grandpa Monkey taking care of his little baby. We, so technically we got all the starters, technically, even though this is not the Sobble card. That's okay. We just saw all the starters there. Let's hit the Vivid Voltage. Uh, knock this one out. Watch this be the series we're going to get the best card from. That would be epic. There we go. Code card. Three to the front. And one Fire Energy. We've got the GOAT. The Stadium of Wyndham. So what was everyone's favorite stadium from Sword and Shield? I thought the stadium series thing was actually really cool. There's a Metang, Electric, Execute, Eevee, looking at those shooting stars, a Woobat, on his perch, Aracuda, getting ready to be eaten by another fish, the Dancing Rock Gem Mama, and, ooh, we got Orbeetle VMAX, which is actually the pack art for this one. How cool. So the pack art and the VMAX don't entirely line up 100%, but that's still cool. We uh, So yeah, we probably just pulled our best card right there with the Orbital VMAX. All right, back to the chilling range, shall we? Articuno, show us something gorgeous like yourself in this pack. That would be epic. So again, let's do the code like so. Go three up to the front, and the energy is water. How about it, honey? 
I guess, uh, Honey, we going for a date, baby? I have no idea. I don't know who Honey is. I, it just looks like a, a mom ready for a date. We've got the impact energy. We've got the snowy fields in which Honey wants to date, stroll, slash go caroling for a sleigh ride together with you. We've got Ralts, <laughs> Quillfish, Heracross, all of these nice, uh, Strike styles, so they're more like action cards. A cast form, sunny day, baby. A sphiel out in the water. Carla, who is at the beauty shop, maybe. She just walked out from getting her hair did. And, oh, yes! Check it out, guys. We've got a Galarian Slow King VMAX Rainbow Full Art. This thing is incredible. Okay, now I think I have a new possible favorite card from the entire series as this is actually the first really good card I've gotten from that series. Chilling Rain, I'm impressed. That is a very, very clean looking hollow, I will say. That is, that's something else. Me likey! On to the next one, Vivid Voltage. Now this one has the Orb Beetle on the front. What are the odds of us getting two VMAX Orb Beetles? Probably very low, although, do you guys remember the video where I pulled three... What the heck did I pull three hollows in a row of the same card? Like, there was... There's no... Was it double? What, there's no such luck as pulling three of the exact same hollow in a row, and somehow we did it. So, anyway, the hot springs. The fish no one likes. The trap fish thing. Energy, the music bird, the punchy octopus, the little shy goat, the ghost, the that, Alistair, the scary, and on the end, Ninjask, the ninja flying bug. All right, evolving skies, because I'm ready to get into this set now. We've gotten something good from each set so far. Oh, I opened that backwards. Well, that's, this one's a dud. So, here you go, and we're just gonna, like, it's an original, like, we're brand new to Pokemon and new to packs. Ooh! Aw! Oh, no, nothing in here for us! Okay. So, we messed that one up. This one, we're gonna get right. <laughs> Open it this way. Here we go. Now that I remembered how to Pokemon card... Here is the code for the boys and girls at home. Here are three cards from the back going to the front. Why do we move three from the back? I don't think I've ever really explained this, but you take three off the back, put them to the front, because then this next card is always your energy card. Always going to be your energy card in newer packs. Starting with... Um, when did that start? Sometime in the Sun and Moon series, I believe. So then this card is your rare card. Always. It's always going to be your rare card right here. So we flip it around, that way the rare card on the back will be the last card we see. Don't know if I ever explained it to you guys why we do that the way we do that, but that's that's how it works. I'm not sure, I've, I've watched a couple Pokemon YouTubers, and I don't know if anyone ever really takes the time to explain, hey, this is why we do that. But uh, now you know, now you know why they all do that. There's the Dream Ball, and on the end, look at that. We've got the Garbage Pile, VMAX, and like I said, guys, that was the last card. There's nothing behind it, so that is your rare card every single time. We got the giant, colossal Garbage Pile that is absorbed an airplane. Um, is that is that a fro is that a Larvitar? What the heck is that? A Politoed or a Larvitar over there? Um, it's sucked in a whole airplane. It's got its own gravitational pull at this point this thing is is absolutely colossal oh man guys decomposable garbage that's what we need here we go we'll show you again Th ah crap code card that's always the first thing on the back <laughs> Give that away to your fans, or use it yourself in Pokemon. You go three from the back to the front, and you take this. Guarantee it's the energy. Whoop! Shoot, we just threw it. But I promised you, I promised you that was the energy. I'm not. Don't have secret cards over here hidden or anything. It, it 
just landed over there. We still have packs, but this was the energy, and that's why it goes here, and this is our rare card, and we flip it around. That's why you see it on the time on videos all the time people doing it that that's why they do it so if you want to know and you, if you just want to you know you're young and you want to impress your friends do that if they don't know the trick to pulling the four cards off the back that's that's how you do it or tell them hey i can find exactly where that energy is without looking at the pokemon cards take three off the back and there you go we've got grandpa monkey and on the end we've got the hat the nice hat fairy Pokemon, which is actually a psychic in this one. And not a fairy type, but that's that. Now to Evolving Skies. So you give your code card away to the boys and girls at home watching. You go three to the front, getting rid of the psychic energy. Bird, the big brave bird. Ooh, an ice pop. Now I'm hungry. I'm hungry for ice pops. A tentacruel down in the sea. A little plant, a little iceberg. A little drowsy, a little scraggy. A little boy needs his uh, little belt. There's a little dragon. Into a little, uh, well, I guess not really little. She's more of a larger flower lady. And a big dog out there in the snow. Guiding some travelers in for the holidays to see their families. Man, even Pokemon got to work for Christmas, you know? Everyone's got a job to do. Here is our code card. Three to the front. And the energy. Darkness. We've got the young lady. We've got the old cemetery. We've got the flower. That looks like a water painting. We've got the swirly puff on the donut we've got the tree fighting back he's not going into your christmas house what this year i don't know what i'm saying we've got the zebra who's stranded out on the island we've got to go save him we've got ghastly causing nightmares we've got coughing spewing toxic clouds we've got the professor saying hey kids time for a college break and on the end we've got big angry zebra coming to save his zebra son okay so help is on the way it's okay. It's okay for that. Was, is it Blitzel, the baby one? Because Zeb Stryka is on the way. I think Blitzel is the, the child. I'm not entirely sure. There's the code. Three to the front and one psychic energy. We've got the... What, what, what was her deal in the game? She was like psychic or something? I don't remember. Ladybug... Old Cemetery again, to Sfeel, into a little baby hat, into Rock Ruff, playing in the snow. That's what I wish we would do, but we don't have snow here, so no snow for us. Shuppet, the cast form is snowy form. I think we've gotten every cast form now. Ooh, lucky energy, baby. And Zeb Strike again, nothing on the last pack. Okay, so, in conclusion, this is what we've pulled. Out of 10 packs, it seems awfully low to get three good cards out of 10 packs. I would say for your money, unless we just got like pretty screwed here, I would say this probably isn't worth $50 or however much that, I think it was $50, but it's not really worth it. I don't think, oh, we do, I guess I should also add this because this is why we bought the whole kit and caboodle here. So you get four, four good cards out of it. That I would say it's not worth it because those $20 boxes, we're pulling about three to four good cards out of those with, like, four, what, five packs, six packs? So I would say stick with those, unless we just got really unlucky. If you guys have gotten more, like, better stuff, we, we may have just hit a terrible luck streak. That could be it. That could entirely be it. But it also, maybe, this is just what you can expect to get. I don't know. Maybe this was like, hey, you got four good cards? I only got two. So, I don't know, but that, this is just my conclusion. Anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Have a wonderful holiday. Uh, enjoy celebrating whatever it is. Spend it with the time where, spend your time with the ones you love. Be sure to appreciate your parents, your grandparents, your brothers, your sisters, your moms, your dads. Just appreciate everyone that you see. You never know who's going to be around uh, to see next Christmas, so enjoy the time that you have. All the gifts and stuff that you get, you'll have plenty of time to play with that throughout the year. You don't have to play with it all right away. 
I promise you. You don't have to run down and do a YouTube video as soon as you get Pokemon cards. Trust me, mine have lasted me all year, and I've been able to keep doing Pokemon card videos. So guys, please enjoy the holidays. Be safe. Think of other people. You know, try and help make this world a better place. Enjoy the time you have with the ones you love. Help them. You know, give them memories that they can share and remember. And I hope you guys all have a wonderful and safe holiday, and we'll see you in the new year. Love you guys. Bye!